The Sharks just averted disaster. On Tuesday night, Timo Meyer left the game early with a serious-looking knee injury. It looked like he could be out for a while, but it turned out that there was no structural damage to his knee. Everything is okay. Timo Meyer is playing for the Sharks tonight against the Edmonton Oilers. But just how big a blow would it have been to lose Timo Meyer? Timo Meyer is third in the league in percentage of his team's shot attempts taken. So number one is Alexander Ovechkin, who has taken 14.7% of all of the Washington Capitals' shot attempts. Second is David Pasternak, who's taken 13.2% of all of Boston's shot attempts. And third is Timo Meyer, who's taken 12.9% of all San Jose Sharks' shot attempts. So that's some really good company that Timo Meyer is in, but that also shows you just how critical he is to the lifeblood of the Sharks' offense. One guy who isn't helping the Sharks' offense anymore is Evander King, who is now playing with Edmonton. In January, the Sharks terminated Evander's contract. The NHL quickly filed a grievance in response. At stake is Evander Kane's Sharks contract, the rest of it, about three years and $22.9 million. That's a lot at stake right there. Initially, the thought was that the hearing the grievance would be heard quickly, but with Evander playing in Edmonton now and loving it from what I hear, and the Sharks maybe not really needing clarity on their cap situation for a little while, maybe until the draft, there hasn't really been any hurry to get this grievance heard. And what I understand is that the grievance will still get heard before the draft, so the Sharks will have that clarity. Uh, but right now, still, there's no date set. Regardless, though, a lot is at stake here. The Sharks need all the cap space they can get as they want to get their way back in the playoffs. But obviously, Evander Kane won't want to lose out on $23 million.